In this video, I want to share with you a really great resource, not only for Maya, but for many uses as well. In this occasion, I want to share with you that the Botanic Tree Library is now available for use with Maya. The Botanic Library of Trees has been available for Blender for a while now, and many swear by how great this add-on for Blender has been. Lucky for us Maya users, the folks behind Botanic, Polygonic have decided to also make the release for Maya. So what exactly is Botanic? Botanic is a very large library of three assets which you can use in Maya and these assets have been set up to work seamlessly with the Arnold renderer. The assets are set up in such a way where you can simply drag and drop them into a scene in Maya. The setup for this is also very simple as you can add the Botanic library to the Maya content browser. This is fairly straightforward and you get the instructions on how to do this when you download Botanic. Once you have the library in your content browser, you can browse through many tree models available for you to use. Currently, they have about 130 high quality models available. When you get Botanic, you can also get free updates, so it's very possible the library will continue to grow in the future. To use the trees, you can simply drag and drop them into your scene. The shaders for the trees have already been set up to work with the Arnold rendering, but you do have the option to also change things like the tree leaves from the shader settings if you wish to. The trees are very detailed as you can see here, these are really high quality especially for production purposes where you are looking to render a landscape. The variety of trees here is very nice as well. One thing I also tried was to use the trees outside of Maya, which you technically can, though you will have to look for the corresponding textures to do so. Here is one of the trees in Marmoset 2 back for example. There is a possibility to perhaps also use them in something like Unreal 5 but this is not something I have tried yet. Overall, I think this is a really nice vegetation asset pack. The assets are very high quality, while at the same time not looking too specific, so they can be used in pretty much any scene. I will leave a link in the video description for you guys to check it out. This is not a sponsored video by the way, but I do get a small portion of each sale for this asset pack. I will say I highly doubt you will regret getting this pack due to the sheer amount of assets that come with it and the usefulness of this pack. Again, there is a link in the video description for you guys to check it out. Alright, that's it for this video, you guys take care, and I hope to see you in a future video.